After teaching the drills in, the, in a shell situation, and then some two-man drills, three-man drills, one-on-one -on -one drills, we're now ready to move on to our <clears throat> first level of live drills. And we will do a cutthroat drill almost every day. And a cutthroat drill is a four-on-four-on-four on four on four situation. So here we have four greens out. We have white with the basketball, and we have four skins guarding white. Um, they rotate a little bit differently depending upon which cutthroat drill we're doing, but um, a lot of times they go from out to defense to offense, but not always, and I'll, I'll explain the differences. I've got three. Uh, you could come up with several on your own. You basically want your cutthroat drills to be live, you want them to be four on four, and you want them to cover what you need to get better at. Early in the year, you need to get better at everything. So we do a lot of what I call regular cutthroat. And on regular cutthroat, if there is a coach out here with the basketball, he will throw the ball to one of the guys on offense, and that first catch, that ball is dead. That person has no option but to pass the ball. A, it works on our ball pressure, and it works on our dead ball denial, which we will do no matter what defense we're in. If we get the offense to pick up its dribble and have a, have a dead ball, we are going to deny everywhere. So the first pass is dead, and then we just play basketball. This coach out here may be watching the offense, and I may be down here watching the defense. It is a defensive drill first, but there are lots of good offensive things going on. And we encourage our kids to work on our offensive concepts. Um, maybe that day we want to work on defending uh, ball screen, so we may have them ball screen a lot, or we may have them down screen a lot. Whatever the case may be, we want them to play play appropriate offense. But anyway, in this drill, we're going to go and defend. It's live. It's normal basketball. All the dribbles you want. And if you turn it over or miss a shot, you are going out. The team that was on defense is going to offense. And the team that was out is now on defense. If you score, you are staying on offense. And the team that is out is rotating with the team that was on defense. So you need to play good defense to get to play offense. You need to run good offense to get to stay on offense. And we may do that for seven or eight minutes. We may keep score. We may not. We want this to be one of the most intense drills of the day.